Okay, Bill, this is uh, Pete King, and I am in the living room now of the uh, unit at La Playa. I wanted to show you that it does have some uh, decent appliances, although these are the original, and you'll notice that the refrigerator is missing. Uh, the countertops are in good shape, and it does have tile in the, uh, the kick plate uh, underneath the, uh, the breakfast bar. What I wanted to show you was that uh, very little has been done in here. So the guy who bought it, I mean, even to the point you can see where he didn't paint everything, he just touched up everything. There's holes in the wall, not too bad. Uh, and the tile's in great shape here in the living area. But my point uh, again is that this place came out of foreclosure. He's trying to turn a quick buck and he really did not want to put any uh, time or effort or money into it obviously sorry for the darkness the electricity is off so I don't have any way to get lights on and it's a little bit cloudy out today you can see some of the uh, <laughs> window treatments are left over although I'm probably uh, thinking that uh, Misty's not gonna want to keep this kind of stuff nor this color which is as you can see kind of a green uh, again pardon the darkness I wish this could look better but basically, this is what the bath is like. Uh, has a, a walk-in shower, a garden tub, and uh, one of the better features here at La Playa is that uh, they do have the two sinks. But again, he could have done, come in here and done granite like you probably will if you bought it, but he didn't. Good size uh, master closet. It's really a great little beach place. Uh, this is a three bedroom, three and a half bath. Here is the next bedroom uh, towards the back of the condo. Again, he left all the colors, uh, didn't do any repainting. The carpet is uh, okay, probably should be uh, shampooed again. Uh, and you'll notice that even to the point of not making repairs on the baseboards, you can see the little spot there on the baseboard. I uh, can't show you much in here. I don't, don't know whether you can see that. That's just one of those inserts. That's not a tile uh, insert for the tub area, and it's just a tub shower combination with a pedestal sink. That's in this uh, one guest bath. And I'm walking through to the other guest bedroom, and it's really dark in here, so let me open up these shades. I'm sorry, I didn't realize this was like this. So this is out the back, uh, looking towards Grand Caribbean, which you probably remember. Same green color in here as it is in the other uh, bedrooms. Same carpet. And again, sorry for the dark, but this is the exact same bath as we saw in the other pedestal sink and just the uh, regular tub surround, not tile. So give you an idea of what, uh, what this place is like. I don't want to talk you out of it. But I do want you to know that nothing much has been done and the seller has told his agent that if he gets any lowball offers, he's just going to reject them out of hand. So I'm not sure whether it's worth it to you, but I'm certainly happy to put a contract out there and see what we can do. Uh, might just have to wait and give this guy some time to come to his senses. So there's a pretty good view of the beach. As you can see from the second floor, it's really nice because you're right up on the beach. It's a really nice uh, beachy feel to this condo. And you can also see, if I can get out here real quick. Yeah, you can also see it's a really nice large balcony here in La Playa, nice and deep. So you can have uh, a table and chairs and also lounges, so plenty of room for that. So I hope this is helpful. I'm going to send this off to you.